right, so let's go ahead and hit record. And welcome, everybody. Thank you so much for coming to, uh, this is kind of an impromptu ses uh, session because I just thought of it a few days ago as we were gearing up this whole new uh, launch of having me be part of the HTC Global team. And uh, you'll hear a lot about me and a lot about sort of this progression and where we're going with HTC Global. Uh, but before I even begin, uh, it goes without saying that none of us would be here without the amazing brain uh, child that was conceived from this incredible woman on my left. I don't know where she is in your uh, your scheme of things, but uh, for those of you who know Camille, yay. For those of you who don't know her, you get to meet her. So let me just introduce you to the amazing woman who started all of this, who's made a lot possible for a lot of us. So Camille Leone. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Lainey. Uh, I want to keep my comments short because really our organization and the meeting is about our members. Um, and at the same time, I want to try and answer a few questions. But we were started 10 years ago and we were started very much uh, in the structure of other professional organizations like a Toastmasters or a Rotary or a little bit less, but also like a BNI, right? They're networks of local chapters. Well, we also at that time started our online presence because we really saw what was going on online and how many people, consumers, in other words, your potential clients, customers, and patients are online, right? Um, and this year, we really saw the need to ramp up our presence online for our members and also to help our chapters expand their reach from just who can drive to the local meeting to who's going to be interested in participating in what we're doing online. So Lainey, who's got a ton of experience with building a few local chapters, um, just seemed like a really natural pick. She has recently uh, ramped up the Food Healing Oracle deck. With a bigger online presence, she has been doing a lot with her Intuitive Wisdom Media Production Studios and uh, just seemed like a really good time and a really good fit for us to expand what we are doing online. Uh, I will be online for, I will be on this call for a portion of this call, so I'll be able to hear any questions or comments and once I leave, then Lainey and I will be reconnecting so that we can make sure we follow up with anything that uh, comes up and really uh, make this and the future of this something that supports all of us, but helps us not just preach to the choir, but expand the size of the choir. Because awesome. that's what we're here for. Awesome. Thanks. Hey, Camille. <laughs> Thank you. And so uh, before we begin, a couple little things. One is uh, I'm gonna have everybody stay muted, if you don't mind, uh, stay muted until the end and then if we can unmute and then I may have you unmute if you have questions. Uh, the chat is off for this. It's a little distracting. I don't wanna have a whole sidebar thing going. So hold all your questions. I hope to answer as much as I can in this short presentation and then leave some time for us to have conversation together. So save your questions as I go along. And um, uh, again, nothing in the chat, stay muted and um, we'll get through this. And, and again, this will be recorded and you'll be able to share this with other people or go back. And if you forgot something, you can listen to the recording later. All right. So some people are maybe having trouble logging on or staying on. So I think we're going to be having that kind of going on for a little while. Mm -hmm. So, um, okay, it's 6.08, but I'm pretty punctual. So I am beginning. Uh, I just want to let you know, I, uh, well, before I even get into the presentation, I, even though I was a president two and a half years ago, um, I've known about HEC for um, almost from the beginning because Camille wrote a book with Barbara Schiffman and they and Barbara is a friend of mine and they she, they were on a radio show. I had a radio show, Zeta Global Radio, it was in 60 countries, very big show. I had a lot of big Deepak Chopra, Deepak Chopra and lots of Deepak Chopra type people on it. 
And um, so I've got to see um, from the periphery HCC grow into what it is. And it wasn't until when I left New Mexico to move to Florida that a need came up. So I have been around HCC for a very long time, even before I became a president. I already knew getting into um, this organization was stellar from the beginning of watching Camille just turn it into the amazingness that it is today that we're all loving. So um, let me just pull that up. Everyone can see this. Uh, everyone can see, yep. Okay, here we go. So I uh, moved to Florida in 2017 and, in July. And for the first few months, I was getting my bearings. And it wasn't until March, I was with a fellow HCC member, well, it wasn't at the time, but a dear friend who runs a spa here and, and was looking for a way to connect holistic services together. And I said, oh my gosh, I think I know an organization that does it in other places. So I looked up and found that HCC was not in our area, Southwest Florida. It was in Orlando and Miami and I mean, just all over, all over Florida. But this pocket that we call Southwest Florida here was open. So I uh, worked with Camille. It was amazing. I started the, with the help of a nice little uh, group of small people, team we started in June of 2018. A month later, we said, you know what, not everyone comes across our bridge. There's a little bit of a separation between cities. It would be great if we worked with Fort Myers. And so Fort Myers, we took under our management. And this area, which is called Southwest Florida, has Naples, which is just a little further drive, about 40 minutes from the Cape Coral Fort Myers, about an hour, 40 minutes, something like that. So we took Naples, we, we kind of birthed all three within a three month time frame, and they were immediately a hit. It didn't matter if somebody was here in this area for two minutes, two years or 20 years, everybody seemed to like find their tribe. It was like this, this, this feeling that everyone knew that this is what they are, but they didn't know there were other people doing it and they didn't know other people were making money and they definitely didn't know there was a community that was like-minded individuals that was available to them that was also elevated and professional to work with mainstream audiences like doctors and hospitals and um, people of that ilk. And there was, and that's what Camille started. And I was so honored to bring that here. And if there's presidents on this call, you know how good that feels. So these ran very successfully. We got a gazillion people. Uh, news press picked it up. Uh, news press did a story on me about bringing this to an actually conservative area where, you know, holistic practices is still, um, you know, wasn't exactly mainstream. We weren't a Berkeley, we weren't a Boulder, we were Cape Coral, which is a little bit more conservative. But News Press, which is part of the USA Network, picked up a whole article and that opened up the eyes to several people, maybe even people who are on this call or who are going to see this recording. And we had some kickoff parties and the rest is really history. We had tons of members sign up. Um, actually, Natural Awakenings, most of you know Natural Awakenings all over the country, yeah. Well, Natural Awakenings is actually birthed right here in Naples. And so Sharon, uh, who is the creator of that, saw that we were here and we started having beautiful alliances with Natural Awakenings. We started um, advertising our panels. We started advertising our showcasing our members. Uh, go ahead, everybody stay muted, please. And the rest is sort of history. This great relationship with Natural Awakenings was born and, um, pre you know, everything, just everything kind of worked for our area. And that was, you know, two and a half years ago. And then we're kind of bringing you up to speed. My other role that Camille mentioned is that my husband and I own a media company and we have a film production company and a spiritual record label that was born during HCC's growth. Uh, intuitive Wisdom Records in a year and a half, we maybe two years now, look how many records we produced. 90% of those are HCC members, if not more. And what was so astounding is that these people had 
their um, their gift, right? Their meditation, they would do it, their yoga, uh, you know, their 10 people at their yoga class, or, um, you know, they would have a small gathering of people, but through the through HCC in this alliance, we turned them into an international recording artist, right? So we made them go local to global through being on our collaborative collective soundtracks or sound, well, we, we do have one soundtrack, but our collective tracks here in one of our albums went number one on Amazon. We were extremely proud. So this would not have happened without HCC. So yes, do I have a love for HCC and what is Camille created and what all of us are doing? Yes. And anyone could be on these records. And it just so happened that the three chapters we had here is where a majority of these were born. Okay. And then we kind of flash forward to this year. We're dealing with uh, COVID, we're dealing with isolation, we're dealing with quarantine, we're dealing with people not meeting as much in person. And at this time last year, my other roles in Intuitive is that I co-created the birth of a food healing Oracle deck. And I didn't know that why it came together last year. I think someone's unmuted. If we could have everybody mute, please, that would be awesome. Uh, so when this idea to bring forward this food healing Oracle deck, let's see, let's, I'm just going to stop and see who is not muted. Does anyone see who that is? I think it be? is, uh, Laura. Laura, Laura? we're going to mute you. All right, let's get back. Okay. So, uh, when the food healing Oracle deck was birthed earlier this year, we didn't know anything about COVID. Uh, we just were guided to bring forward this incredible product. And through uh, a Kickstarter campaign in January, this started to happen and right in the middle of launching the Kickstarter COVID hit. And everyone was um, quite panicked, but it seemed like the work that we're doing as food healers and intuitives really kind of struck a chord. And how, how are we marketing it? So what ended up happening is that over the course of the summer, um, we, I started to spend a little bit more time um, in addition to the local chapters on the global chapter and learning about, wow, there's all these incredible people who I think would love to know about food consciousness. And I spent some time there and lo and behold, I started to meet people from across the country in Canada. And as a result, somebody in HCC Global was a member, they're the publisher of Epic Magazine out of Tri-County, Connecticut. And they hooked me up with the Tri-County publishers in Colorado. And suddenly, uh, Joanna and I are in this, this month's issue and we have a two page spread and they did a whole interview on that. That happened because of HCC Global. We've been guest speakers now since most of the local meetings, um, the local chapters are doing virtual, right? So a few have been invited us to be keynote speakers and that has happened and that can happen. You know, what I'm suggesting and saying this happened to me can be all of you, okay? It's nothing magical on my end. This is just what my, what's happened for me. Of course, we've had people from HEC Global buy decks from people all over the country, not just my local Southwest Florida know about the deck, we started to meet people by posting and getting sales from across the country in Canada. So I saw, wow, how amazing this global chapter is and um, wanted to know more of this. And I was already starting after two and a half years and um, having sort of less of a presence because of COVID and nobody was meeting because our area happens to be very seasonal. Okay. So in our area, people come for a certain amount of time, you know, uh, from up north and then they leave and it's all very seasonal. Well, due to COVID, less people were coming or if they were here, they went back quickly. So our whole balance of who was in town was not happening. And so, and there was a lot going on. So we weren't really having the attendance we once had. And so we, I had to look at for myself, how to pivot my business, right? How to pivot my time and as my food healing oracle deck business was demanding more of a um of my time i realized that i um, needed to step down as a president and focus my time on the deck and so i had to make a very conscious pivot because i birthed those babies those three chapters so happy to do that but i just felt like my time was needed somewhere else and then as soon as i made that conscious decision i spent more time on the food healing oracle deck 
this beautiful opportunity to be here presenting to you came forward and it was not even something I was going to think twice about. Even as busy as I am with the Food Healing Oracle deck, I knew that this is my home, has been my home, and I know that meeting all of you and the amount of inquiries, we got inquiries today from people who want to be members in Spain. Um, we know we have people in Canada interested. We already have Canadian members. I mean, it's endless who can be attending this global chapter and getting your product, your service, your workshop seen. I'm seeing it for myself. So I made the pivot to global. And because of my experience, I've been a global director of other networking groups and I've done, been a president a number of times. You know, I'm so grateful that I had this opportunity to help helm this and support all of our members and sponsors who really want to brand through our organization. So the pivot happened and that's what happened for me. And that's where we are currently. So I wanted to- uh, Lainey, Yeah. Before I leave, I just want to uh, add one thing so that everybody Perfect. is clear. Those of you who are live here today, those of you who are watching the recording, which is when we say the global online chapter, all of our members can participate in the global online chapter. Good if point. your home chapter is a local member, that's fine, a local chapter, that's fine with us. We started with our network of local chapters. We just have this global online chapter to make sure that all of those members can really expand their presence online and that all of our members who are nowhere near a local chapter and still want to get involved have a home chapter as well. So Perfect. all of our members all over get the global online and some members are based in their geographic location and others are based in our now virtual world. And with that, I just want to thank all of you for showing up. Uh, I will be answering questions and figuring out things with Lainey as we continue to expand this. And of course, we'll see you in the group. Yeah. Thanks, Camille. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Bye. Bye. So she's right. I embrace the local chapters wholeheartedly. If there's an, is there any presidents here from any of the chapters? Okay, cool. A couple. You, um, are, as a president and someone who ran three chapters, you can always reach out to me. I've, um, I, I've, I've mentored other presidents before. I can offer great advice and success tips. And so this isn't an either or, this is a collective community. I've had so many members move away and we're devastated. How am I going to be involved? And this is great for them. I have so many members who don't want to come um, right now and be in person, but if they are part of a local chapter, that is its own sacred community. And then this is just a global community because if you are local, which is phenomenal, but you have a product now that you've turned online that you said, you know what? I used to just do this in person. Now I only do it online. I would love to reach somebody in LA and I'm in Florida. I would love to meet, reach, have somebody in Spain buy my product. I would love to talk to someone in the Isles of Trinidad. That is happening. We're going to be getting people and members from all over the world. There's, there's not even, it's not even a, um, if it's a when, because it's already the inquiries are coming in. I've, I'm also very networked globally and people have already reached out to me. I already know that's going to happen. So you get the benefit of your local membership and all that networking and your membership includes that. There are other networking groups where you have to pay a mint to be in a global. This is all included. So we are working collaboratively with the uh, local chapters and your membership includes this whole global arena where I'm gonna be spending some time with you, okay? Again, some of you came in later. We're muting all of our, um, if we can mute all our communications and then save your questions to the end and the chat is off right now. Okay, so let me just get through a couple more slides. And again, there's a mix of people here. Some of you are members. Actually, let me just see with a show of hand. How many of you are members? Okay, how many of you used to be a member and you're considering coming back? How many of you have never been a member before? This is totally new to you and you just want to learn all about HTC. Okay, great. 
So there's a little mix, but some of a lot of you are members or maybe now know people who want to consider being members and they're not part of a local chapter because they've moved away or there's just not one in that area or one has closed. For instance, my area has closed, is closing. We're just the finishing touches because I'm not president and we didn't get another president. And so my group of people have moved over to global and now we're all on here. So it's a whole mix of different people. All right, let's just finish up and, and then I wanna leave time for some questions. So on the global, we talked about networking with like-minded businesses from owners coast to coast in Canada. Yes, that's true. And like I said, there are people coming in from other countries now who wanna network and build their brands and you build, you get to showcase your brands to them. There's an opportunity for brand awareness. So I'll be getting into sponsorship a little bit later. And not of all, I don't know if you know this, but not everyone is a business, um, a holistic business. There are a lot of people who come and be members who want to be part of this community, who want to learn from our products and services, who want to get our discounts because all of us are so generous and kind and loving, right? We're always giving something away or giving discounts. I'm going to be giving away a bunch of stuff tonight for you all being here. That's just the way I am. And so there are, there is a membership available for people and for uh, anyone who wants to, if you don't even have a business or you're in the middle of a pivot and figuring out what you're going to do next, because for some reason, COVID shifted that for you, right? We're in the middle of like powering up pivoting. That's what I'm saying here. Uh, utilizing the new prevalent use of virtual meetings, you know, that, that might have been popular before, but now it's a mainstay. And I think that's going to continue well past the COVID times, okay? Um, the monthly global for those of you who didn't know, and honestly, in the two and a half years, I was so darn busy running our chapters. I didn't even participate in one monthly Zoominar. I was too busy trying to get to mine, but um, there is a monthly Zoominar in HCC Global, which is a monthly meeting. They're the second Tuesday of the month at um, 9.30 uh, Pacific or 12.30 Eastern. Okay, so that would be next week that Donna's gonna be helming. Yay, Donna, she's member services here. She's an important person you need to know. She'll say a few words. And if, if you want, Donna, if you want, and if you, but if you need something with your membership, she is your girl, your goddess who will do things and she does things fast. So those monthly global Zoominars, she will be running that. I'll pop on next week. So this runs just like a chapter, except when you become, um, if you don't have a chapter in your area, your chapter is. If you were, if you lost a chapter per se that one closed, it means you automatically get turned into the global online. And again, you have that choice. If you have a local chapter that's existing, it's already included in your membership, okay? Uh, we have over a 50,000 uh, person reach uh, followers. We are on Instagram. We are on Facebook, right? We know that. That's the big group. We just changed it today with a new title. Uh, we are on Twitter, uh, huge following on LinkedIn. These are all places, especially sponsors that are going to be branded. If you participate in any of these things that you're going to be seeing right now, I just launched the 12 days of Christmas. I'm going to be highlighting 20 members, 24 members, your name and lights and camera. You're going to be seen in a lot of places. We're developing our Pinterest. Yay, Donna, I think has some, has a lot of energy. Anything you want to say about that, Donna, while you're here? Not to put you on the spot, but I know Pinterest is your thing. Yeah, well, I've, I've just got to started doing it and so i'm doing a lot of posts right now um i we have a member spotlight um area we also have a chapter highlight area so if there's things or events that are coming up and you want me to put them on uh pinterest you can you can email me you know um, a photo an image and then you know, a little bit about what you want to say about it. And I, I can get it on our Pinterest. I'm also trying to email people and get them to, you know, if they are on Pinterest to follow us. Awesome. So, yeah. All right. Well, we, we will make a point of that in the Facebook page to let people know. Yeah. And yes, you can, there'll be video opportunities on our YouTube. That's growing. If you get a chance to subscribe, subscribe there. And so lots of ways to be seen. Our network, again, over 50,000 followers and growing, growing, growing. This year, there's been growth online like, um, like more than ever. 
you know, for obvious reasons. All right, for those of you who are not members or need to remind um, people how this all works. So here's the path to global membership. And then again, I'm gonna leave some time for questions. Uh, current members, it's automatic. I just mentioned that, it's automatic in you. You don't have to do anything. If you uh, know people who've left or one of you had, didn't raise your hand and you wanna consider coming back, reactivating or someone who's listening to that, you have to see me and I am able to do some special things for you and which is a uh, waiver application fee and you don't have to do the processing of getting references. I can, you know, we can just streamline and that's only through 1215, okay? So if people have left and they wanna come back you know, they didn't know global existed and COVID changed things for them, but now they realize that they have to be online. Whatever the reason is, it doesn't matter. We will support them through 1215. They just need to reach out to me and we'll make sure that we get them taken care of. And then Don and I will hook them up. Okay. New members, uh, there is a global application process. You'd be seeing me to apply. Um, it requires two references. By the way, did anyone know your membership is tax deductible as we're coming up on year end? Something for all of you to know, very important, okay? Uh, these, these are the prices, okay? For some of you who already know this because you're members, but I just want it to be clear for everybody and everybody because we have a melting pot of people looking at this. It's 199 annual. And if you pay that in one lump sum, you get two months free. Otherwise, it's $20 a month, and that includes two people in your membership, plus there's a $35 registration fee, okay? So that is our, our, uh, our basic level, if you will, our professional, and then there's a business level, and that's $3.99, and that actually includes four people, four people from the same business. So it's $40 a month, but if you pay it in one sum, it's, uh, you get two months free. Okay, so those prices haven't changed. Now I want you to take a, a closer look at this next slide. There are, as Camille said, many organizations out there, right? She mentioned BNI, uh, there's Toastmasters, there's Rotary, there's so many groups, okay? It's finding your tribe. It's finding your like-minded conscious beings who are gonna relate to who you are and your product and service. And so if you're here, most likely that's our group, which we are a melting pot. It's so many people, so many different types of beings in our group that are all working together to refer one another and not really create community. BNI is about 800 a year. Master Networks, some of you know that, that's in about 18 states. There are about 700 a year. There's the Leeds Club, that's more Pacific Coast or West Coast. And uh, we're 199 plus the $35 registration fee and you get a tremendous amount of value. And if you get involved with our sponsorship, we actually throw in a membership. So that's another discussion. But I want you to just realize the value of what you're getting is exponential at a very low rate um, of being involved with us in a local chapter community and being um, automatically into the global program. If you don't have a local chapter, again, you would be part of the online chapter, which the president of that is Camille and I'm you know, the membership global online director for that, okay? So again, save your questions to the end, we will get to them. I mentioned sponsorship because a lot of you, I don't know, um, how much money you're spending on Facebook for brand awareness or Amazon, if you've got a book. I know a lot of you have a diff all different things out there, but you know how much ads cost in magazines and you know how uh, the value things are very expensive, especially to get your name differently out there and boost posts and buy ads. And it goes on and on and on. Well, we've created a very comprehensive sponsorship uh, package and it's as low as $168 a month right now. It's so, um, I mean, that's like an ad somewhere. I don't even, I mean, that's like a quarter page ad somewhere. You're getting a 12 month program uh, where we are gonna brand you on all the outlets we talked about today and then some. It's a very thorough package and the value is extremely reasonable. And there's a special going on right now. And please see me because the special is only through 1215. So if it's something that's even resonating with you and you know what your marketing dollars are and you, and you start calculating how much it costs to promote yourself on Instagram, on Facebook, on Twitter, on LinkedIn, on Pinterest, on YouTube, 
you know what this costs. It could be hundreds. I mean, I know with the Food Healing Oracle deck, we've spent thousands a month and we are having wonderful success just uh, being in HCC. So we've really looked at the value personally. And I'm, I'm, I'm saying, please consider sponsorship on a global because you would be a sponsor for 12 months in the global um, whole entire arena of our, our organization. Okay. So again, you'll be branded across the USA and Canada and you'll connect with your target market. I'm assuming you being here, you're, you're seeing that this is your target market. And again, um, it's tax deductible. So that's why we also want to have it through 1215. So you can get your tax write off. And then we have two weeks for our corporate office to start onboarding you and starting you as our 2021 sponsor. Okay. So if that even resonates with you and you're wondering what that's all about, see me. I, it's very easy. I'm very accessible and I can help you get situated. We already have people coming on board. They already know the value of marketing because they do it in their business all day long. They know what things cost. Okay. So hear it from our HCC members. I love this. Okay. I know you're like, what are all those ears? But look at all the colors. Look at all the different people we have in HCC. This is kind of like who we are, this big, amazing melting pot of colors and ages and demographics and gifts. And we got the psychics, we've got the doctors, we've got the Reikis, we've got the tarots, we've got everybody. But I wanted to, you not just to hear it from me because I can go on about all the successes I have. And I think I'm, I'm pretty... Um, uh, accessible to say that what's happened to me can happen to anybody else. But I really wanted to see, is there anyone, maybe Heather or Tony, or is there anyone who just wants to say like quickly how it's worked for you, Charm, if you want to say anything? Um, um, why don't we start with you? Because I haven't met you before, but I've heard about you. Just want to say, okay. we'll just be really brief. <laughs> okay. Hi, Lainey. Nice to meet everyone. Just so excited to be part of the Holistic Chamber of Commerce. I've only joined a few months ago. And I, you know, I really like to take advantage of the opportunities that are out there. So when I first joined, I looked through the whole, um, you know, dashboard, the directory, you know, ability to, you know, put all your links in there and, and take advantage of, you know, meeting and collaborating with all these great people. So I myself am, um, am a web designer and a marketer. Uh, most of my clients are holistic professionals. That's how, and I, I myself teach um, mind, body, and spirit. Um, I teach a martial arts called Aikido. And I just dived into the Holistic Chamber of Commerce and just took advantage of being at this event, joining this chapter, meeting with people, you know, being part of whatever you offer. And when you do that, you get so much back. Yeah. So I really appreciate this community. I do, you know, encourage those who haven't joined take advantage of this. There's a whole wealth of people here who have expertise in all areas. So I may not be an expert in this area. I'll go to them and ask and just may, saves me a lot of time and money too, because I get the answers right away. And we're just, you know, wrapping our hands around everyone. So it's, it's great. And we need it right now during the COVID times. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. Thank you. So thank you for that. And uh, I hope to see you more on the global uh, page. For sure. Um, yeah, a couple other people, Tony or Heather. Heather, well, Heather's from Canada. <laughs> yeah, I just wanted to um, express my gratitude for Holistic Chamber of Commerce and the opportunity to sponsor. I've been a sponsor of um, the educational panels and what was the Holistic Chamber of Commerce Health Fair. Uh, and the exposure that I got was phenomenal. And the excitement that has gone, I mean, it takes a while for any new business. I was new in April, 2017, and I met Lainey in 2018, and she and I've been working together ever since, mostly through the Holistic Chamber of Commerce. And the exposure that I've gotten is starting to pay off now. And be, just because we're running campaigns and we're seeing the numbers, we're seeing the hits, and it's very, um, it hits my heart. And it's very heartwarming to know that the company that you're keeping also is heart-centered. And uh, thank you so much for the opportunity. And I really look forward to taking advantage of the global community because I haven't even done that yet. So yeah. I'm really excited about this. Yeah, thanks, Heather. Yeah, I think we're gonna see a lot of Heather too. Uh, Tony, we'll take one more. Tony Hi. Michael. 
How are you? I'm Tony Wangle, and uh, I'm a holistic health coach, and I'm also a feeling food healing oracle deck certified reader. Um, the chamber has really helped me expand um, personally as well as with my business. Uh, you know, there's a lot of avenues to put your your stuff out there and although I never took advantage of the global, I didn't really think about that. I'm definitely going to do that now, but um, it's also helped me come out of my shell a little more and realize my talents and sh to share them with the world. So I'm grateful for HCC for that. Um, and then I just made a lot of, met a lot of nice people, great people that have become family to me and um, lots of friends and it's just a great way to connect to other people who uh, have the same mindset as you. Awesome. So, thank you. Thank you. Tony just recorded her first meditation with us. We're so excited. She's going to be an international recording artist. Look at her go. All right. So uh, let's just finish up and then we'll uh, answer some questions if you have any. Oh, I guess that was it. That's just my information. And of course, you'll be able to find me in lots of different ways, but super easy. Laney at holisticchamberofcommerce.com. Please take down my phone number and um, you can reach me. Donna, did you want to say anything else before we answer any questions? Yeah, I'll just say real quickly, if like Laney mentioned, if you need anything with member services, um, my phone number and email are on the website. Just, you know, contact me. And also I want to say take advantage of, there's a few things that you can update your profile and help people find you. One of those is uh, key search words. A lot of people haven't put that in there. Um, you know, what, what you do for a living, you can pick up to, I think it's five words on a regular professional membership and add those words in there and make sure your social media is in there. Also the links there that helps, uh, you know, you boost your, your SEO. So yeah, take advantage of what's in the profile. Go like charm it, go in and look through it and see what you can update and, and help your, you know, boost your people finding you. It's like a website, really. Uh, I know people who've used their website or their profile on their business cards, but these days, not even people are handing out business cards. But the profile is uh, the directories looked at a gazillion times a day, and, and that is where a lot of hits are. So make sure that is current. If you are not a member, make sure you, when you become a member, you do exactly what Donna says and, and, and really start on your onboarding process. And we'll help you with all of that, that, that you get your um, profile updated and your local president will help you with those things as well. So you have a lot of support, uh, whether it's your local chapter, it's the corporate office that we're here for your success. We're here for our success. We're here for all of our successes. And we are just broadening our approach. If your local chapter is a certain you know, mile radius, you have all of that access in that family unit. And now you have this bigger family unit that is spanning the cross countries now um, who can see you and support you and um, collaborate with you and create workshops with you and do all the things that you want to do and find, like Tony said, friends and family now too. So it's a wonderful, wonderful way to be, especially during these times where we're all learning at wanting to be safe and you know, environments that make us feel good. Uh, we wanna be able to um, be environments that raise our vibration and make us feel good and allow us to thrive and allow us to be abundant, right? So that's what this place is. Any questions? Charn, did you have a question? Go for it. So let me unmute myself. I manage the Holistic Chamber of Commerce Instagram. Excellent. And so I just wanted to let everybody know that if you have an Instagram account or plan to create one, um, we feature members on the Holistic Chamber of Instagram, you know, uh, Instagram account. We feature them in stories. If you have upcoming, upcoming meetings or speakers, uh, if you published a book, you know, all that, you know, we just tag us at the Holistic Chamber of Commerce. I get notified. I check it daily, if not every few hours. And I'm hungry for content. So, you know, the more you give me, of course, I have to, you know, space it and, and um, publish it when it's right and how it looks on the Instagram board. But in stories, 
once they're published, they get moved over to the highlights. So if you have an event or you have a speaker, or you want to feature something, it doesn't get lost. It gets saved on that Instagram account. So super familiar with it. Um, and I want everybody to take advantage of it and just make sure you tag us uh, so that I can see what you're doing. Okay. That's it. <laughs> well, I'm thrilled. It's funny because Joanna just pulled up. That's my partner in produce with the Food Healing Oracle deck. And last Sunday, um, News Press, right? News Press, mainstream News Press had us right. on the cover story about our Food Healing Oracle deck. And suddenly I saw it on Instagram. I was like, wow, HCC, like you're quick. <laughs> so yeah. I know she's on it. All right. Any other questions that someone may have for yourself or a member or your chapter or anything having to do with sponsorship or membership or if you've moved I away? I have a quick question. Yes. Um, so if I have, let's say, two other people and it's a global meeting of the month, um, can I invite them to come once or I guess they can because they pay that guest fee, correct? Yeah, that's an excellent question. So if you are not a member or you have people who want to come to our monthly meetings, which are run by uh, Camille, except for next week, it'll be run by Donna. In January, I'll be the featured speaker on how to um, 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 market and how to go global. Uh, I'll be the featured speaker there with Camille. Um, it's $15. Um, some of you chapters charge, you know, and we used to charge when I was a president uh, locally, I, uh, we charge. It's $15 and you can come twice to a meeting and then you uh, then it requires membership, okay? So great question. Yes, you can come twice and it is um, a $15 charge unless you are already a member, then it's uh, free. So um, yeah, perfect. So if you do want to um, have somebody do that, Donna, did they see you or who, who registers or how did they pay that $15? That's um, through Eventbrite. Through Eventbrite. Okay, okay, very good. Okay, excellent. So I'll make sure we get a link in the global page for them who are our current members. If someone does want to participate in that, we'll make sure we will get you that Eventbrite link. Okay, so we want non-members who won't see that in their emails um, or their um, global page yet because you have to be a member. But if you know someone who's interested, we will get you that Eventbrite link. Okay, make sure somebody I have a question. It. Okay, is that Stephanie? I yes, I have a question for Sharon um, about the Instagram. I've been a member for a year and I had no idea that we had an Instagram connect. Um, how do, other than tagging you in the post, is that the only way to alert you to something or? Uh, yeah, is... so I check um, the post um, daily and I see the tags, you know, there's a little notification. And so I'll look through it. I'm like, okay, I'm gonna, I, I love what she's doing. So I'm gonna either repost it directly onto Instagram or I will, you know, take the information and kind of uh, redesign the graphics. So the colors and everything fit the brand. Um, so I can help with that. I also do comb through the members uh, Facebook page uh, and to get any updated information that you don't need to tag me. Um, and then I'm going to start going through any other Facebook, the, the large, uh, the larger organization one. Um, if global. I want content. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So and, Stephanie, are and, you a member? Are, do you, have you, are you in the group for the global? I haven't finished my, I haven't finished my question even showing. If, oh. Can I, can I just finish that first? And you then sure I'll come can. Back? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. So um, you just do Instagram. Is there a counterpart for other social media like Facebook or um, TikTok or anything else? Or, or are we just trying to start with Instagram and then possibly expand out? Well, we have our Facebook that members can post to. And then um, I do have access to the Facebook uh, page um, for the Holistic Chamber, but that's something we want to um, make sure that we, you know, we were careful in promoting, um, and it's only for like business-related things, uh, major right. Holistic Chamber of Commerce events. But you know, Instagram is where I have fun. I can feature you in stories, put you in highlights, repost your stuff. So definitely, if you have Instagram, definitely tag me. I'm very active on that. Got it. Okay. Thank you. Sorry to cut you off, Lainey. I would just wanted to, I had to finish that train of thought before it left the station or otherwise I was never going to catch it. I totally get it. Do you, Stephanie, have, are you in the HCC Global Online group? Not yet. Um, awesome. That was the reason why I came in today. Perfect. Um, talked to Camille about um, joining it. 
because it's something that I do want to do. My um, practice is virtually online. I went oh. from being um, a, a one-on-one face-to-face only yeah. to mostly online to virtual clients. So um, this does interest me greatly. And where are you located? I was in Maryland. I'm now in Arizona. Excellent. Okay. That's yeah. a, that's the a great thing about that global online. Doesn't matter where you go, you're still connected. So right. yeah, just but, if you decide to find your way there, we'd love to see you. Well, I'm I'm confused because I, you know, it's been a while since I've been on the website, but how does one find the global online chapter on the website? Um, it's not on the uh is it on the website, Donna? Um I think where's Donna? We'd have to ask. It's yeah, not, it's not on the website, but the emails that Camille sends out has all of the. I think there's two a month that go out with all the meetings and all the updates with what's going on with the Global Online chapter, and then you can get involved also with the Facebook group too. And if you're on Pinterest, also we can um, highlight what you're doing too. Okay, thank you all for the information. You're welcome. Um, as of today, uh, the name, what used to formally be called Members Only HCC, Holistic Chamber of Commerce, the new name for that global group is Holistic Chamber of Commerce Global Online Chapter. So if you look that up, that will be the name of the group, not the page. There is a holistic web, there are Holistic Chamber of Commerce Facebook page. But the group where we're interacting as a community, just like most of the chapters, I don't know, at least the ones, the three I ran, we had the page for our our city. And then we had a private page, which was for members only, where we were doing all of our internal interacting as uh, members. Same thing. Um, There's the page for Holistic Chamber of Commerce in general. I'm not part of that. The group is where I'm actively promoting all of us and creating uh, value added and finding ways for you to be showcased um, along with everybody, um, you know, coming in and the sponsors. So it's now called today, Holistic Chamber of Commerce Global Online Chapter. Okay, we have time for just a couple more questions. And again, Lainey at holisticchamberofcommerce.com, I can answer anything. And if I don't know the answer, I'll be sure to go to the right person. And I'll be seeing Camille tomorrow to uh, follow up on some things. Yes, Wendy. Thank you, Lainey, for all your service tonight. This has been really helpful and interesting. And I, I, I had that feeling that I just love to know every one of you here tonight, what you do and how I can serve you and vice versa, all that good stuff. And, and so my first question is, Am I automatically a part of the global since I'm a member and have been for quite some time? Is that yes. just a bad thing? Okay. Yeah. You just need to join the group if you've never done it before. And I have to be honest, I was so busy doing my own chapters. I barely was over. I knew there was this other page. I'd, I'd post there occasionally. It wasn't until this summer that I realized the value of it when Joanne and I launched our book and our deck. And we, we wanted it to, you know, we want to go worldwide. We're in several countries now. And I think the chamber had a lot to do with it. So yeah, you're an automatic member. All right. And I know I don't make the most of my membership. I assume I should go back and listen to Camille's video. Again, that's part of it. And just really thoroughly yeah. read the emails. Yeah. yeah, and come to the monthly. I mean, uh, John is going to be doing like breakout sessions next week and you get to yeah. meet somebody, you know, could be the Isles of Trinidad or it could be Alaska or Canada or your Arizona. It could be anywhere, but you're going to meet, you're going to start meeting people. We're putting a lot of energy. Camille likes to call it rocket fuel. She brought me on. I have a lot of energy. She, um, we're really going to be nourishing that global page to work in collaboration with the local chapters, chapter, chapters, to really infuse that page as its own community for the people who don't have a local chapter and creating all sorts of opportunities for you guys to really see the value of your membership and to see success in all that you're doing and all of you who've had to pivot, because I know everyone's had to pivot one way or another this year and we are following that wave. In fact, we were, you know, they were really doing this well before, but it wasn't 
didn't take priority until it did this year where a necessity is asking, had us go all online. So I think you're gonna see so much more now in this global chapter. Thank you. Yeah. Julie. I and actually, what, uh, yeah. I wanted to say thank you for being here today. I'm, I'm super excited to be here myself. And um, I've been a, the president of the Ventura chapter for a couple of years now. Oh, cool. Um, and this is my first go around with any kind of networking. And so what I was wondering is I totally love the idea of this global chapter. And I love the idea that it comes along with our membership. Yeah. And I really want to um, bring that to the table because our, our chapter has continued to grow even through COVID. We've signed on a couple of new members, which is kind awesome. of interesting to me. But I would love an opportunity as a chapter president to have some um, maybe guidance or mentorship from someone like you to help continue the local um, activity that happens here because eventually we will be out of COVID, just not now. And then um, also to share the excitement of what you're developing here with our local community. So well, I, I would love to do that. And I, you know, I could be one of your monthly speakers. I can, you know, put together a little customized presentation for your group and share relevance of what it's like. I'm, by the way, born and raised in the Valley. I'm from Woodland Hills. So, I mean, I'm from your area. I'm now on the nice. other side. But yeah, if you'd like some of that and we can talk, but I, you know, I'm really good at helping get people excited about what we do here and why the local chapters are the, uh, you know, the bread and butter the you know, of community. And I'm just the extension now on this global and we're working all together in this kind of oneness, this, this global oneness. This is, you know, for people who had to pivot, they, they, need to, they need to grow their businesses. So whether it's Ventura mm -hmm. or it's LA or it's San Diego or it's Florida, your, your clients everywhere. And I think they're waiting for you all, if not collaborative, collaborative partners in the global chapter because you didn't get to see them before and you're all having virtual meetings you could be virtually meeting with everybody joanna and i spoke on the west coast to one of the chapters and they didn't have that before everyone was staying in their group now we could all be talking to everybody and that's what it's all about is you know expanding our community one other question I have regarding the global chapter versus the local chapter is, um, is the global chapter going to take um, or have op or offer opportunities to the local chapters to be highlighted or to be um, of, of service to the group or that sort of thing so that we can play a more meaningful role in the whole? I think I think all of it's up for grabs. You know, it's I'm a oneness person, and so is Camille, and so we'll be yeah, looking me too. at tons of platforms of ways to showcase. We might even have a chapter of the week and have you come on and do a Q and A or a Facebook Live. We'll think of lots of things that we will be showcasing everyone, okay, cool. so they all see that together. There's no question. I've only been on a job a week, and it's been very busy. Okay, so we will have lots of things. We will have lots of ways to interact because that's what we want. We want everyone in Florida to know about Ventura. We want everyone right. in Canada to know about Kansas. And right. that's what we're starting to do is get everyone interacting. And we may even start to have on global, like, hi, I'm Julie from Ventura. Hi, I'm Heather from um, from Toronto. It's Kitchener. I got I was, uh, from, you know, Toronto area. But it's good to start people seeing where we're all from, you know. This guy, Timothy, he called in from Spain going, I really love what you're doing over there. And mm -hmm. like, wow, people should see. Wow, what if someone from Spain bought a workshop from somebody in LA? Like, that's what we're going for. Right on. Okay? Thank all you. right, we're almost done. Does there anyone have a quick question? I know, and you can reach me anytime. So please do. Tarn. Okay, there you go. Well, there's so many opportunities um, with, you know, the Holistic Chamber of Commerce. I, for myself, um, uh, run wellness.com, and it's a website that allows all our holistic practitioners to become contributors, you know, write articles, blogs, um, insert your links. Uh, we boost the posts on Facebook. Uh, and so it's just a way to get your message out just as, you know, that's a channel, you know, Instagram, Pinterest. And I actually am running a whole side gig summit event. And many of the uh, guest speakers are Holistic Chamber of Commerce members, which I found through the chapter meetings and, and they were relevant as a guest speaker. So each time you, you participate, there are opportunities and don't be afraid, you know, we're all here to help. So it's, it's just wonderful. Thank you. So when I post something, 
engage, answer. You never know who's watching what you wrote, who posting. You just might find that next client right there. I'm going to put my contact info up again. Okay, it's Lainey, L-A-I-N-I-E at holisticchamberofcommerce.com. Okay, 239-785-0809. And you can uh, you know, direct message me if you're on Facebook, uh, uh, foodhealingdeck.com. I got a lot of ways to reach us uh, in me. So if you're interested in that sponsorship opportunity, uh, again, if you be want to become a member tonight um, or over the next three days, um, have you been watching me drink out of this phenomenal uh, Holistic Chamber of Commerce Yeti cup? Okay, it's the best cup in the world. Who's got one, by the way, Who on here? Who has one? Yeah, there's a few of you. It's the best cup in the whole darn world. I was going through my supplies the other day and I found one more. They had all sold out. So anyway, someone's going to win this. If you end up becoming a member in the next few days, I'm going to say like Saturday, if you, I get your application between now and Saturday, you'll be entered to win and you want this cup. It's amazing. Okay. Uh, if you are reactivating, I'm going to waive your fees and your processing fee. Uh, new members, regardless of whether you win this, I'm sending you a little gift as a welcome. Thank you. Okay. So everyone's going to win something for being here and being part of the energetic vortex that we call HCC. So please pass this on. If you're interested in sponsorship, understanding how to market all these ways that um, Tarn and I and, Sean and Donna are talking about and uh, the Pinterest, the YouTube, the Facebook page, our email blast, over 50,000 followers for 12 months. Please see me. And uh, I think we got it seven o'clock on the nose or wherever you are in your time zone. Thank you for giving me your hour and your attention. And if you want to reach me, you know how to do so. And I wish you the best in everything you do, no matter what you decide. Thanks so much, everybody. Click below to subscribe now.